with us. Just know we for real in love. We real people with real problems. A real marriage, but we gon' solve them. Love is love, so we keep evolving. And don't you judge, just keep on watching, okay? But keep it cute in the comments, though. Cause trust and believe we reading all the comments, though. And if you know one thing, we keep it 100, though. You rockin' with Britney and Dory, the show. Let's go. Britney and Dory. and Dory and we are Brittany, Brittany and Dory. Dory so we first want to start off by saying happy new, new year, year. <laughs> we made it 2022 Woo. you know what baby what every year everybody has a new year resolution okay do you have one this year um I'm gonna be honest I have okay. not put too much thought into it okay I haven't thought about a new year's resolution until right now honestly too Okay, so have you, you have one right now or are you still kind of thinking of one? I think I know what my new year resolution is. Okay, well how about you share first and as you thinking of or saying yours, maybe I'll come to okay. uh, an agreement on what I want mine to be. Um, I would say my new year resolution is honestly, I think I want to go into 2022 being a better person. I think I want to work on just my EQ. Okay. You know, like, I want to be able to, like, I don't know. I think I just feel like it's just something that I think that if if it was a true goal, not weight goal, not, you know, I don't have any of those kind of things right now. So I think that, honestly, 2022, I want to be a better person. I want to, like, remove gossip about my life. I want to, mm -hmm. you know, be able to touch other people in different ways. Not that I don't feel like I already do that now, but just in different ways that, people I may have not touched in 2021 or, mm -hmm. you know, just kind of being able to be there for people more so than I have in the past. Okay. So I think I just want to be like in tune with other people. Other people. And, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's a good one. Yeah. Now you mentioned EQ and most people out there may not know what that is. So what is EQ? Well, I say EQ for sure when I forget about what it is. <laughs> <laughs> No, but it's technically uh, emotional. Mm -hmm. um, goodness, what's the key part? Let us know. <laughs> what's the key part? Intelligence. There you go. Okay, I was yes. like, yeah, so it's just emotional intelligence. Kind of like, you know, one thing that, um, you know, I've heard a lot in 2021, honestly, is that I don't have a high EQ. Mm. And Who told you that? My baby is telling me. Dang! <laughs> Who said that? But I, Who I said that? that? We're fortunate. <laughs> No, but and then like you know later on when you hear so many times it's like you know sometimes they say when you hear certain, so, something so many times you start believing it mm -hmm. but honestly i've heard it so many times i actually have start, started to see it mm -hmm. and wait have you heard it so many times just for me or do you feel like you've now heard it from other people i feel like i've heard it from other people and okay. i feel like it's probably been um something that i didn't realize even in friendships okay that i've lacked and that's probably sometimes now where i why I stand where I stand with certain people mm. if that makes sense you know friends family just in general so I just feel like that's just one of the things that you know I can just sit back and just be like I could do better with people not that I'm not a good person because I am <laughs> but you know maybe sometimes I'm just like a should be all right or okay I probably should have said it differently so I just mm -hmm. need to watch how I say things to certain people because not everyone is so direct and blunt and can take it the way I possibly can take it right and I need to work on that. So that's just something that I want to do in 2022. I've actually kind of have started it in 2021 where, you know, sometimes at work now, I ask people, how was your weekend? Or I might, you know, okay. you know, or I might Do ask you. about, you know, a family member that they mentioned or, you know, a side hustle that they mentioned or something like, you know, I, tr I have tried because, you know, you know. Yeah. I no, like I, think it, I think it's good that you've recognized it outside of me saying it sometimes yeah. when you tell your partner something they can be they can become defensive because maybe they don't feel that way they don't feel that you know the same way about themselves as you do mm -hmm. but I feel like when you leave with love and you just try to tell them to help them to grow them and they eventually recognize it on their own I always think it's a beautiful thing that you kind of yeah uh just 
you know, now acknowledging it and now wanting to do something about it. And it also helps, obviously, if other people have told you that. Yeah. Um, again, it's not that you're you're a mean person. You're one of the sweetest people I know. Yeah. However, you definitely will not go out of your way to, you know, to spark a conversation or to, I don't know how to yeah. explain it. And I don't always feel like I've always been this way. I think that over the years, life has made me this way. Mm. And I think that it's probably because of, you know, you know, one point, you know, being a friendly person or letting people in and feeling like people have one either taken advantage of me or, you know, um, or it just didn't go the way I expected it to go. So I think I've kind of shut myself down mm -hmm. from people yeah. in a way. And I think now... As I get older, you know, sometimes I do feel like, you know, I've had this conversation like so many times. I have a whole, I have a hard time seeking friendships now. Yeah. And it could be because I've gotten this whole thing like it's not that people don't want to be my friends, <laughs> or you know, I don't meet people. It's just I don't go out my way to keep relationships going. Yeah. And that's something I want to work on in 2022. Also, just to kind of say another thing, I do want to have, and it's not a really, I don't even want to call it a New Year's resolution because I don't want to put a time frame on it or, you know, it's something I don't, I don't feel like it has to happen next year, but I would like for it to happen. But I really, truly do, would like to somehow start something of my own. Mm. And I don't know what it is. I don't know. I'm going to pray on it. I'm going to, um manifest it whatever it is even though i don't know what it is i really truly hope that god guides me to my purpose mm -hmm. so that's something you know 2022 that i want to you know start doesn't have to be you know happen in 2022 but at least i'm on some kind of track yeah that's good baby thanks it's gonna happen for you thank you you know it i know in due time yeah literally we just talked to somebody who said like yeah God just blessed me with the dream that I've, you know, mm -hmm. had for a long time. So. Yeah, and hearing that and hearing her story, honestly, was, like, definitely inspiring. Mm -hmm. And, you know, I just sit back and I'm like, man, God, read my line. <laughs> <laughs> read my line. What you want me to do? <laughs> I will do it. But you know what? He's already given me some of the greatest gifts in life that I can even, you know, that I... I'm so blessed for that, you know, if he didn't give me anything else in this world, I'm truly thankful. But, you know, I do want to find my purpose, something to truly make me solely happy. Like, not make, you know, something that's mine, you know? Yeah, not absolutely. even that it will make you happy or, you know, I think it will make you happy seeing me happy. Mm -hmm. And that, you know, but the same thing, like, it doesn't matter about how it would, you know, make, it doesn't matter what it would do for you. It's just right. truly for me. Right. And, you know, eventually it will be, it is for both of us because it's whatever I decide to do is going to benefit both of us. But at the same time, it's truly my purpose. No, I agree. I, I think you should seek that and I pray that God gives that to you. Thank you. And he will. He will. Yeah. Sure. So I kind of, you know, took over. So no, I like it. Then, <laughs> I like it when you take charge. Girl, I take charge. So, I mean, with my, you know, me telling my New Year's resolution and things I want for 2022, baby, have you thought about something that you want to? Um, I'm, like I said before, like I hadn't really put too much thought in it just mm -hmm. because, number one, I don't know. I haven't. It's not to say that I haven't been big on New Year's resolution. I think as I've grown older and just became an adult, I realized that um, the new year doesn't bring, it doesn't bring up a change unless mm -hmm. you're willing to change. No. So that's with anything in life. So a lot of people will get in the gym on January 1st or that first week in January or the first month and then um, it fades away. And that's just because it's, you're you're setting a false hope so mm -hmm. i would like to think that i just want to welcome in blessings all the blessings and grace and mercy uh that god has for me in 2022 whatever that may be um i'll be finishing up a huge huge project at work this year so that and then obviously the birth of our firstborn child will be this year so i don't really have necessarily any new year's resolutions I just ask that um, 
God has stored me everything I need to get through this year because I know it's going to be a huge undertaking for me. Um, I pray that, again, like I just want his grace and mercy. Um, I just want him to sprinkle a little patient dust on me. I want him to sprinkle a little just um, even patience with myself and understanding for myself. I think I get feel like I have to be superwoman sometimes and I don't I, I know it, it's gonna be it's a huge year mm -hmm. that's all I can say like I have a huge smile on my face because it's a huge year um so I just hope for a better me every day a better me for me and a better me for you mm -hmm. um dang I should mm -hmm. woo -hoo -hoo! I'm cold with it mm -hmm. I want to be a better me for me mm -hmm. and I want to be a better me for you that's real. Yeah. That came from the heart, but boy, you heard that. Your mama spit it. Anyway. You know, I do want, you know, you to be a better you for you and a better you for me. And also, you know, a better you for baby Britt as well. So I feel like, you know, overall, just, you know, a better full circle of you. Yeah. You know, so I just, you know, I wish that upon you as well. Thank you, baby. Anyway, they're probably wondering why we got all these gifts around. Yeah, here. we we wanted to number one just tell y'all happy new year. Yeah, give y'all our resolution. Let us know some of y'all's yeah. resolutions in the comments below. Drop down in the comments below what your resolution uh, will be for 2022. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's one, two, three. Who knows? Drop it in the comments below. And if you agree with what somebody else has written in the comments, go ahead and thumbs up their yes. comments. Help them manifest their resolution. Yeah, yeah. How about we pour into each other in the comments? So uh, we're going to have a little New Year's whatever in the comments mm -hmm. below. So do that. Yeah. But before y'all go, before you go, would it be in 2022 we're going to start the year off right First things first, just make sure you subscribe. If you look down and you see that that subscribe button has not been hit, go ahead and subscribe to our channel. If you have not, go ahead and hit that notification button. Bing! <laughs> because anytime we put out a video, you will be notified so you can be one of the first to watch our video. And last but not least, make sure you like this video and comment below. For sure, for sure. So with that being said, it's your girl, Brittany. And Dory. And we are Brittany and Dory. Peace and creep. Stop what you're doing, hit the subscribe button And if you've been subscribed, then you've been riding with us Ain't nobody gonna hold you down like I do Stay true to you like I do Spoil you like I do Adore you like I do Clean for you like I do Cook for you like I do Ride it down with you Ride it down with you And that's why I said I do